Um, this should be episode 20, if I'm counting correctly, or it would be 19 or 21. Whichever it is, it's the last one for me to do right now. And what we are going to 100, of course. With a creeper in the way, I need to talk about a few things. Um, for the way it's set up right now, the way caves are set up right now, for new start, it's not particularly easy to get to caves in particular. And there's a lot of things I need to talk about. So we need to... Well, I'll talk about the first part and then this. So let's go. How? Leave me alone, man. Jesus Christ. Leave me alone. So relentless. Oh no you don't, no you don't, you're not gonna catch me, I'm going to do the video and there's nothing to do about it. It's still day, so it's best time to make the video. And then the night is when I talk about the other stuff, which is kind of gonna fit in perfectly what I have to say. And then it will be an early end to the video. It won't be of too much of purpose, but more of a review of beta testing. to get up there <sighs> our inventory is full on fighting alone this is not good it's not good at all our inventory shouldn't be full on fighting alone So we'll come back to talk about some stuff, but really and truly, there's a lot of stuff that definitely needs to be talked about, man. A lot of stuff that really needs to be talked about. We can't talk about it. We like have like six minutes or five minutes of day, so we definitely need to go and talk about it right now. No. If you're playing Caves and Cliffs and you're like using a world that you already establish and have like good gears and a lot of iron and resources and stuff like that farms iron farms and stuff like that you're gonna ram me aren't you this will not be too 
difficult for you but like for anybody that is really like starting off in a brand new world it's gonna be very difficult for you and i will go through it in steps now what makes what makes this difficult is finding iron that is what particularly makes this very very difficult now there is two ways to find iron either you get into a tall mountain the higher up you go the higher the chances of you getting iron finding a mountain is not easy but it's doable and in the series further on we're gonna be looking for it now the thing that is gonna make things harder for new players in particular like if you're starting up a new world is that caving is much more difficult early game so we basically are early game we don't really have much things and what makes caving very difficult is the way how iron is very hard to find in certain circumstances and in order to find iron easier you have to put yourself in risky situations like down there and the problem with down there is like you see it um enemies is coming from left to right all over the place which i can fight off it's all right but like uh an experienced player will not be able to fight off it now what I mean by cave access is very difficult. Now, let's dive. This is what a cave entrance is for. And let's get this amethyst. Let's get this right away. This is the problem with it. At early game, you don't have enough oxygen. Trust me, I know you don't have enough oxygen. Uh, it's not going to be the death of me. So, for early entrance into the caves, what you're looking for are stuff like these. The problem is, at early stage, you just don't have the oxygen capacity to dive down to the deeps, depths of these and like enter into any cave. So, this already is very difficult to enter caves in particular. I don't really see any sort of normal cave entrances like before and that is kind of a problem or uh, it may be much more hard to find entrances like that and normally as a new player you're going to be going for these type of cave entrances and believe me it's you are never ever at the early stage going to be able to enter a cave by diving into here and going down into a cave you just will never ever have the bread for it and i don't know if that is something that you need to change or not but it does a heads up you are never ever gonna be doing it like that unless you've been playing on the game world before and you have the equipments to do it otherwise it will not be possible now that we're talking about that we need to go down and talk about this now this is a very good way to start off entering your caves like digging down into the breach one this is the best one that i recommend 
but the problem is going down there is gonna be very difficult as you see in my last video if you've been watching I had to do a lot of fighting and it, there's a lot even lighting up the area to a great extent will not stop the spawning of monsters it is the same as how it is for the woodland mansion no matter how much you light up that place it will just always be spawning monsters regardless of the light level and it's the same thing for down in there i don't I'm just gonna always have monsters spawning no matter how much you light up the ground it's just gonna always be that way and you just always have to be on your square and ready now the difficult this this is all like all right everything about it is all right the problem about it the thing that makes it not okay is that finding iron is very difficult like it's extremely difficult like right now I have to make a brand new iron chest plate that I had before and I have to make it over again because the scraper snuck on me from behind and blow me up and the one thing I lose was the one extremely rare to find thing and that is the iron which it just sucks you know it sucks so prepare yourself for that you're gonna be Look at what I, all of these stuff, this, this, and this, and gunpowder, was from fighting alone. Like, I fought so much in that little time. It's just absolutely ridiculous. And I don't know why. I don't know why someone had to fight that much. There's a witch. These are not things somebody should be going up against in the early parts of the game. And I guess the best option is to stay out of it, yes. But like, what's the other alternative? The other alternative is to go up in the mountains and search for iron that way. Which can work. But you have to find the mountains in particular in order to do it. This is a fun update, yes. I just have to give you the warning that yes, you're going to have to fight, scratch and crawl and fight your way when you reach to this part of the game. You're going to, there's no going around it. It's not exploring it passively. You're just gonna have to do it. Like, the main reason why I go up in that area of the world was to. was to stop monsters from spawning and coming down in the water because, like, it was screwing me up. But it turns out, like, I, ha I have to leave that alone. And I have to just go my own way you know, and explore the world. So, there again. I don't think it come around good. And there's a creeper that spawned 